The camera culling feature, found here in the G-Scatter optimization panel, now has a new Use Active Camera option. When both boxes are checked, G-Scatter automatically uses the Active Camera to perform the culling operation. By the way, if you want to learn more about the camera culling settings in G-Scatter, please watch the optimization video on the Grassfeld channel. I've put a link to this in the description. Active camera culling is particularly useful for when you have multiple cameras and want to switch culling over to the active one. Just select a camera to be active, as you would normally, by clicking on the camera icon in the Blender Outliner. As we do this, you can see that culling now switches automatically too. Great stuff. Thanks for watching.